Well, with temperatures in the 90s, plenty of people are packing the shore to celebrate, relax, and beat the heat. Eyewitness News reporter Cleve Ryan is in Seattle <laughs> right now. Happy 4th, buddy. Happy 4th, Yuki. All day it's been sunny, warm, not too, too warm. And what else could you ask for? People really taking advantage of it, coming to the beaches and big crowds today for the 4th of July. From splashing around in Brigantine to pick up football in Sea Isle, there are lots of reasons why the beach is the place to be this Independence Day. It's amazing. It's so beautiful out and uh, just being here with my family. Playing with your sisters and friends, beating my dad in beach games. <laughs> is that true? <laughs> it's not true. Yes. It's not remotely true. Not so interested in competition, two-year-old Callie Nelson was all about the water ice. Uh, yummy. And speaking of yummy, we learned all about homemade waffle cones at the Yum Yum Ice Cream Shop in Sea Isle, where owner Charlene Seymour is happy to see crowds flowing into town. It's going good. Everyone's down. It's fun. It's warm. And with the 4th of July on a Thursday, many people will make this a four-day weekend, a best-case scenario for seasonal businesses. The town filled up probably on Monday, so the week started a little early for the uh, 4th of July, and everybody's happy. They're on vacation. Everybody's sporting their red, white, and blue, um, you know, proud of, to be American, and it's just a fun time. And to top it all off... We're going to see fireworks tonight on the beach. And those fireworks begin at 9 o'clock. You can see them anywhere throughout Sea Isle, but they launch from a barge off 50th Street. Reporting live in Seattle City, Cleve Ryan, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right.